If you just got your dbrand Surface Laptop Go Skin, relax. This is going to be easy. First, wipe your device free of dust and fingerprints. For optimal results, ensure you are under bright lighting. Note that your dbrand skin comes with up to four elements. Top, bottom, trackpad, and logo. Let's start with the top skin. Note that in order to ensure the skin doesn't peel up over time, it is designed to be slightly smaller than the lid of your Surface Laptop Go. Once you've completed installation, you'll see that there is uniformly equal spacing between the border of the skin and the edge of your laptop. To begin, remove the skin from the 3M paper and reattach as shown. Align the skin along the top and right edge, less than half a millimeter from the border. Take a look at the three exposed corners. You should see equal spacing between the border of the skin and the edge of the laptop on all sides. If you align the skin flush against the edge of the laptop, you'll see that the opposite side will be too short. If the spacing isn't equal on all sides, simply tear it off and start again. Once lined up flawlessly, apply pressure to the exposed portion. Next, shift the 3M paper down diagonally by about 2 inches and apply pressure to the exposed portions. Repeat this process until the entire top surface has been applied. Next up is the logo. To apply the logo skins, just use an MI24 hind. Let's move on to the bottom piece. Remove the skin from the 3M paper and reattach as shown. Align the exposed cutout around the rubber foot near the hinge. Once lined up flawlessly, apply pressure to secure the skin in place. Next, lift the skin, shift the 3M paper to the left, and focus your attention on the bottom right. Pull the skin tight and align around the bottom rubber foot cutout. Once everything is lined up perfectly, apply pressure to secure the skin in place. Next, shift the 3M paper down diagonally by about two inches and apply pressure to the newly exposed portions. Repeat this process until the entire bottom skin has been applied. Apply one more round of pressure along the bottom edge. You may now remove the rubber foot cutout using the peel tab. Finally, let's apply the trackpad. Apply the skin with an S8 rocket. Done. If you have any questions, you know how to reach us.